The gospel is about making it possible for people not to have to experience that spiritual death, that second death of total, complete separation from God. The scripture says, when they ate of the tree, the eyes of both of them were open. They realized they were naked, so fig leaves together and made coverings for themselves. Sin separated them from God. They had fear they never had before. They had shame they'd never had before. Isaiah 59 says it like this. Surely the arm of the Lord is not too short to save, nor is ear too dull to hear. But your iniquities have separated you from God, and your sins have hidden his face from you so that he will not hear. That's exactly what happened to Adam and Eve in the Garden of Eden. That's why they hid among the trees of the garden. They heard his voice in the garden. They were afraid because they were naked, because they were exposed, because they didn't have anything to protect them from this holy, righteous, powerful God that they suddenly felt they needed protection from, that they didn't feel that before they disobeyed God. They didn't feel, feel that before they, they responded in unbelief and doubt and fear, thinking God was holding out on them. God had something that he wasn't giving them. God was going to give them everything. Everything that the devil promised Eve in the garden, God was going to give it to them in his time and in his season. But he brought them there for fellowship. He brought them there for teaching and training. He brought them there to spend time with them. But they weren't willing to wait on God's schedule. Ephesians chapter 4. So I tell you and insist on it in the Lord that you must no longer live as the Gentiles do in the futility of their thinking. They are darkened in their understanding and separated. There's that word separated again. When we say death was, it's separation. That's what's wrong with the world today. People are separated from God. That's what's going on all around us. People are separated from God. They are darkened in their understanding, separated from the life of God because of the ignorance. When what is ignorance? Do you know there's a difference between being ignorant and being stupid? Do you know the difference? Ignorance just simply means you lack knowledge. Stupid means you might have some knowledge, but you totally lack wisdom. Darkened in their understanding, separated from the life of God because of the ignorance that is in them due to the hardening of their hearts. Having lost all sensitivity to God, they have given themselves over to sensuality. So they've left the realm of the spirit, and they are back here in the realm of the body. See that? They, they have lost all sensitivity in the spirit realm because their sins have separated them from God, and they're, they're darkened in their understanding and separated from the life of God because of the hardening of their heart. What's their heart? We said heart was synonymous with what? Spirit. And they've given themselves over to sensuality. What? They've, they've abandoned the spirit realm, and they've come over here to the fleshly realm and given themselves over to sensuality so as to indulge in every kind of impurity with a continual lust for more. That's the state of man without God in his life. Here's what.